Welcome, in front of me is an iPhone 11 Pro and today I will show you how to transfer data from an old iPhone to the new one. So, as you will see, this device is completely new. As in, there is the setup screen of the device. So if I pull it up, select language and further on. And if I plug it in, I will have this screen. So, welcome to your new iPhone and basically set up as new or restore. So, what you want to do is plug in your old device and for me it's well, basically the same generation of an iPhone just a bigger one so plug it in using the cable and uh, let's just wait for it to show up so from here let's go in here um, as you will see uh, I named it test so it's a little bit easier actually it's, I think there is already a test so let's make it test 2 so it's easily distinguishable between all the devices that are basically named the same. And from here, you wanna do a backup now by tapping right here. Wait for it to backup. And that will take a little bit, it might take a little bit longer in your case, depending on how much data you have actually on your device. Now for me, I believe it's just a bunch of photos and uh, maybe like an album of a couple of songs. I'm not exactly sure, uh, but it's not, a lot so it will take most certainly shorter amount of time to back it up than if your device is fully jammed 64 gigs full of data so once it's done which it's about now okay you can unplug it and set it on the side and now let's plug in the new device so there it is still in a setup phase and from here you have the option to restore from a backup and you want to choose the name of the previous device which for me as you've seen I named it test2 so it's right here that's basically what the one and it's also you have a date where it was created so today at 1258 so right now and all I need to do now is just tap on continue and the restore will begin And there it is, so the process is now finished and we can go on our way to set it up. So let's unplug it, it's not needed anymore. Continue, just gonna skip connecting to Wi-Fi. And there it is. So the backup is now, oh, our restore is completely finished. And if I open up photos, you will see that there are photos. Now, as you've seen previously, the device was completely new in a way that it wasn't activated any kind of way. So there was no way of actually uploading photos apart from the restore that we have done. And as you can see, it has worked considering there are photos. And yeah, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.